Well, it's time for another Patreon poll. This week, I have a very interesting and possibly divisive question. Are most Americans stupid? Now, I will tell you my feelings on this because I thought long and hard about this. Uh, but first, I want to go to what people are saying about this. Now, keep in mind, this is obviously not a scientific poll. It's a very small sample size, but I still think that it's really interesting to hear from people and see what they have to say. Uh, going into this poll, I expected the results to be kind of mixed, but to my surprise, it was skewed heavily in one way with most of my Patreon followers definitely saying, yeah, most Americans are indeed stupid. So I asked, to what extent do you agree slash disagree with the following statement, most Americans are stupid? So as you can see, uh, most people voted totally agree. <laughs> Seven people voted agree. 12 people voted somewhat agree. So that is most people saying that they agree at least somewhat. One person saying, I don't know. And then we have five people saying totally disagree, two votes for disagree, and zero votes for somewhat disagree. Now, this is honestly surprising. Again, very small sample size, but um, it's surprising because I didn't expect that much people to be that cynical. But at the same time, it's not surprising that people are cynical given the political climate. So, um, yeah, I, I want to talk about this. I'll share my thoughts. I do want to get to the comments first because I think that what people share here, it really did influence the way that I would have voted here. So Justin personally says, if you have to ask, dot, dot, dot. Good point. Miles says, I said totally disagree for two reasons. First of all, the majority of the country is rational, but our broken institutions, electoral college, gerrymandering, representation in the Senate, give the false impression that a much larger portion of the country believe in insane Republican ideas. Secondly, many kinds of powerful media, particularly legacy media, have successfully propagandized a large portion of the country. I don't feel like it's fair to call those people stupid when they were born and raised in such a bubble. Adam Zayas says most Americans are ignorant rather than stupid. Chris R says, I don't think that Americans are stupid per se, more like misinformed. Take my father, for example. He has an IQ of 140, one of the largest vocabularies of anybody I know, great at mathematics, but believes our government is run by shape-shifting lizards. Holy shit. Some of the craziest people are seriously smart on a constant quest for knowledge, but come to the wrong conclusions. Walid Dumuni says, I'm an immigrant who has lived in three countries before coming to the United States. Americans are no more or less stupid than other people around the world. Each nation has its own blind spots, which seems to another nation as being stupid, but in reality, this kind of judgment is a blind spot in itself. Kanji Sanada says, I would say they are more uninformed than stupid. The people know we are getting a raw deal, but get distracted with culture war issues. Yeah, so lots of really thoughtful comments here, and there were more that I didn't share, but people have a really nuanced take on this, and I think that they ultimately came to the right conclusion. Um, in terms of how I would have voted, I would have been the only person to vote somewhat disagree. I don't feel strongly about this question either way. Instinctively, I would answer, yeah, most Americans are stupid. Look around you. I mean, if you're going to be susceptible to propaganda when you know propaganda is out there if you're going to keep falling for these cults of personalities sure you may be uninformed but at some level you have to take responsibility for yourself but ultimately i would vote somewhat disagree i don't think most americans are stupid that's not to say i think there are no stupid americans i mean marjorie green lauren bobert these are two very stupid people in congress elected by individuals who were likely very stupid i don't think that these people are just misinformed or, you know, misguided, I think they're actually stupid. And when I say stupid, I mean, I think they have a low IQ. I think that they should wear uh, helmets when they leave the house. I'm surprised that they haven't spontaneously died by forgetting to breathe. So there are stupid people in America. That being said, I don't think most people are stupid. I disagree somewhat. Um, but I'm a little bit, <sighs> I'm waving on this, right? I, I go from somewhat agree to somewhat disagree. Um, so maybe I could be in the I don't know category as well. But for me, this is difficult. Because I think that you can be very stupid, at least when it comes to politics. But that doesn't necessarily mean that you're stupid. I mean, one example we were talking about in the last Patreon live chat was uh, Ben Carson. Ben Carson is a neurosurgeon and he is... I mean, if you listen to the way he talks about politics, he sounds like a fucking moron. So to know that that person is also 
a world-renowned neurosurgeon. I mean, you can't be stupid if you're a neurosurgeon, but at the same time, your politics is dumb. So even if you are stupid politically, that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to be dumb overall. Because I think that if you are an architect, for example, if you are an engineer, well, you're pretty smart, right? You at least have some capacity to think critically, seemingly. So just because you have bad politics, it doesn't mean that you're stupid overall. But I think it is important to note that people do easily get misinformed. People get led astray really, really easily. And that is a problem. That does kind of lead me to err towards somewhat agree. But ultimately, I don't agree. Now, one thing that initially got me thinking I agree that most Americans are stupid is because we keep electing people who are not looking out for our best interests. And it's frustrating. Even if most Americans have somewhat good instincts, they agree with progressives and leftists on policy when you look at the polls, well, they keep voting for either Republicans or neoliberal Democrats. So there's a disconnect there, right? And it's nuanced. It's not just, oh, well, you say you support Medicare for all or raising the minimum wage, but you vote for politicians who don't support it. That means you're stupid. It's, yeah, I support a $15 an hour minimum wage, but this culture war issue is more important to me. It's, you know, the $15 an hour minimum wage is less salient to me than uh, CRT because I don't want my kids to be taught that white people are bad because that's what I think CRT is. So it's it's complicated, right? But ultimately, I am going to thwart my cynical instinct and move away from agree, and I'm ultimately going to land in the camp of somewhat disagree. Because, again, people are complicated. Um, you know, it's think of politics as one separate portion of our lives. It's hard to disaggregate politics because it affects virtually every aspect of your life, but you have to do that because people don't necessarily put two and two together like that. People are different. Some people will think, well, you know what? I'm a Republican because Republicans are looking out for my best interests, and that might be stupid, but they could be a fucking, I don't know, brain surgeon. Who knows, right? But the point is that people are very different in the way that they think about things in the way that they view the world it's also going to come down to their experience and a uh, point of privilege for them what they care more or less about so ultimately i i don't think that most americans are stupid but that doesn't mean that i don't think there are stupid americans because there are some people who are honestly too far gone and really really fucking stupid and one way uh, one thing that i was thinking about uh, as i was pondering you know how i would answer in this poll if i were to vote is um how much does me doing the human support skew my worldview because five six years ago i would have said totally disagree americans are not stupid they're rational they make decisions that are bad for them but it's still it comes from a place of ration uh, rationale where they think okay this is best for me they're not just like doing things that they're that are knowingly going to hurt them but over time, you know, when you cover the worst of the worst, when you talk about Lauren Boebert's and the Marjorie Greens of the world and anti-vaxxers consistently, you kind of warped your own worldview. Um, so I, I wonder how much of that has skewed my take on this and, and made me more cynical. But ultimately, when I really think long and hard about this, um, I always land on the place of disagree. Now, you know, that could change. Who knows? But for now, you know, I think that I somewhat disagree, but a lot of people don't agree with that. They agree, for the most part, that most Americans are stupid. So, yeah, honestly, I'm curious to know what you think in the comments section. Do you think most Americans are stupid? Again, remember, most Americans, not all Americans. Uh, I don't think it's a specific American thing. I think there are elements about our culture and society that's really stupid that we embrace. Um, but again, we're, people aren't monolithic. People are unique. People are complicated. So ultimately, I would say we're not stupid. Prove me right. Recovery mode, my brain ideas. Recovery mode, my brain ideas.